A shout, a shout from the bleachers there, come on, New York. Well, I've just been handed the name of Miss USA of 1974, and the four runners up, a decision that all of these girls have been waiting for for many, many months. I say many, many months because they have been in pageants in their home states, earning their way here to Niagara Falls. Now, girls, I wish you all the very best of luck. The fourth runner-up for the title of Miss USA is Miss North Carolina. Congratulations, Miss North Carolina. There's your bouquet. And I hope you know, I hope, I hope you realize what a favorite you've become tonight and how many people have cheered you on. Thank you very much. Thank you, Miss North Carolina. Now, our third runner-up is Miss California. Gail, congratulations. Thank you very much. As a Californian, as a Californian myself, I am very proud to have had you back here to represent our state, and I think you have just done splendid. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now, our second runner-up is Miss Wisconsin. pleasure meeting you. It's been a pleasure meeting you, and if I need an interior designer, I'll know where to come. You sure will. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Now, girls, one of you will become Miss USA of 1974, and the other will become our first runner-up. Now, this position of first runner-up is very important, because if for any reason Miss USA could not fulfill her obligation throughout the entire year, then the first runner-up would become Miss USA. The first runner-up is Miss New York. Miss Illinois is Miss USA of 1974. Congratulations. On. Now, Miss Hospitality, will you snap her banner for her here? There you are. Thank you. And her scepter, Amanda. There's your scepter. And now we have found the most beautiful girl in the USA. It is Karen Morrison here of Illinois, who will represent our country in the Miss Universe beauty pageant in Manila in the Philippines on CBS on Saturday night, July 20th, when our show will be done live by satellite. Now, Amanda, will you please read the Miss USA Creed? And Miss USA of 74, would you go out?